preview. A mother of three, a GMO mosquito activist against it. She was anti-GMO mosquitoes. Uh, her name was Myla Demir, age 45, a Florida Keys realtor who owned her own real estate company. She was a Florida Keys activist known for fighting off the release of these genetically modified mosquitoes near her home. She died yesterday morning. She was found dead in a swimming pool in Washington, D.C., where she was there to fight against these GMO mosquitoes. Matter of fact, Myla Demir, age 45, was found face down in a swimming pool at the hotel in Washington, D.C. Convention Center at 9.35 a.m. yesterday morning, according to WJLA. The Washington, D.C. Fire Department says the drowning happened at the Cambria Hotel and Suites, Washington, D.C. Convention Center. And medical crews attempted to treat her, but later pronounced her dead. People across Florida have taken to social media to pay tribute to Demir, a seemingly tireless activist who was in Washington, D.C. as part of her fight against GMO mosquitoes. You guys remember last year, I talked a lot about this, how that they created these GMO mosquitoes, how that they dumped millions of them on Brazil, how they said that these GMO mosquitoes were going to sterilize the real mosquitoes, but instead they mutated and Zika broke out, unbelievable uh, on a biblical scale, and uh, not only in Brazil, but even in the southern part of the United States. And uh, so Myla Demir was fighting against them being released in her hometown and in the Florida Keys. Matter of fact, sometimes you just got to do what you got to do. That's what she posted on April the 8th on her Facebook page. And then she, she tweeted or she uh, posted, EPA better get ready. If you ever saw her in action, she was a true inspiration, posted Justin Harvey of Orlando, Florida. And she took on many challenges over the years, including her crusade against GMO mosquitoes. She uh, posted by Mary Lou Hoover of Key West. She was always there for anyone in need. Just prior to her death, she was in Washington, D.C., getting ready to meet with senators and representatives. But instead, she was found dead in a swimming pool. Catherine Norris of Key West called Myla Demir a mentor. Prayers to her family and all who loved and admired her passion, Norris says, and we will continue your plight. Myla Demir was 45 and left three children. She was a realtor in Key West where she owned her own company, Southernmost Realty. Yeah.